Hey guys, welcome back to the Shabna Show. We just completed the holy month of Ramadan and we had eight celebrations already. Eid Mubarak to everyone and may Allah accept your fasting, your prayers and your good deeds during the holy month. Um, I am back again at Rockaway Roti Shop. Remember where I did the video uh, during the holy month of Ramadan when Brother Hafiz provided iftar for the Muslim community? Well, he did the same again for Eid, where he had a breakfast for everyone. Okay, so here I am again with Brother Hafiz from Rockaway Roti Shop. And um, he really did an excellent job with providing breakfast for everybody after they left the Masjid on Eid day, right? So I didn't get to come because we prepared breakfast for the family as well and everybody came across there, but I'm still happy to be here with um, Brother Hafiz to talk about it. Well, the breakfast was nice with my desire to do something for the committee. Uh -huh. and no, no special day than E-Day for the, doing something back to the committee. I remember when I came to this country first, um, things were tight and my, my uncle invited me by him for breakfast after Eid and he was so, you know, mm -hmm. so loving. Yeah. Well, since then, it uh, influenced me to know when I'm in a position to do things. I started to get a family, invite the family, and then fortunate for me now today I can invite the public in wow. New York City that's great uh, that's great being given back to the people them that support me through the year and again I believe in giving the more you give the more the Almighty would have bless you definitely I mean yeah uh -huh. and I have I have seen, seen it so much time at one time when we break down the margin that's Aberdeen margin Aberdeen we don't have no money uh -huh. <laughs> And, uh, I went to them to show some money. Uh -huh. And it's amazing to know the blessing I have received from that. Very good. It's not one time, several times. Mm -hmm. And then I realized by giving, you don't look forward to get. The Almighty just bless you. Yes. So I encourage each and every one of my brothers and sisters, don't scare to give. In this life, when you can afford it, give. When yeah. you want to give, give. give. And Give wholeheartedly and don't and expect anything in return. Right. Yeah. When you give, yeah. Do the right hand, don't make the left hand see or make That's the left right. hand know. Yes. Because a lot of people have give just to the give to expose you. Yes. But the, the silence you can give, the Almighty is seeing. Yes. And then where the blessing comes in from. There you go. There you uh, go. This restaurant has been open since 2005. 2005 I opened this restaurant. And by the grace of the Almighty, I am doing good. I can't complain. I, I accept and I bless what the Almighty have given me. And today, Rockaway Roti Shop has been recognized throughout New York City for the wonderful food that you can see there, for the wonderful and the service that we have provided. When I opened this restaurant in 2005, <laughs> it was amazing. So I, it was my desire because at those in 2005, we have hardly any West, West Guyanese restaurant around. It's all Trinidadian. Okay. And I said, I have two advantages. I have Guyanese food around here I can open, and I'm going to open my halal, which I know it's tough to get halal and Guyanese food around this Richmond Hill area. And yeah. this Richmond Hill, South Coast of Barbie, dominated by Gary's. And you know what? From day one, I opened this restaurant. Marshall, Okay, that's good. From day one. But you know what? I'd be on top of the food. I can cook and I know to cook, but they don't allow me to cook. <laughs> but I guess you pass your skills on. I always correct the cook when it's not too good. I'd be on top of them every day. Every day I'm in this restaurant here, I've been on top of all the chefs that have cooked. Because I know to cook more of them. Okay. I know what is it. And I try to make my food, my whole restaurant, 100% up-to-date standard with the rules and regulation of food. Not in New York City alone, but in the whole, where food is concerned, to get your food up-to-date. I have been to the class two times. I have my certificate, so I know what is it. Uh, and this class has helped me tremendous to keep my restaurant maintained to the highest extent where food, food and hygiene is concerned. 
So now we are checking out all the delicious food that um, Brother Happy is at here. So this food looks so good. Just come to see what we have here. These are all Guyanese cuisine. Yeah. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah, Bigan choker, fry bigan, pumpkin, saltfish, a curry, cow heel soup, coca rice, mm -hmm. and this is liver curry, pachauni, mm -hmm. duck curry, goat curry, yes. chicken curry. Wow. Not curry chicken, chicken curry, <laughs> chew fish, mm -hmm. curry fish, this is egg bag, chicken, chicken, chicken oh, egg bag. Chicken egg bag, oh, yeah. okay, okay. <laughs> it's beef chow mein. Mm -hmm. Uh, the house special fire rice this is the brand fire rice vegetable fire rice chicken chow mein. that's the lunch special that one there okay and this is jerk chicken uh -huh. barbecue chicken uh, and that's a chinese fried chicken to the lion there. these thighs look delicious yeah. and we have um, chicken foot at the back there salsa right and tennis roll Ball, So when you come to Rockaway, you know what you're getting, you know the boss. I've known about food, what it takes to, to get good food, what it takes to have food to spoil, and how to protect your school for not to spoil it. So the boss has been wrong, he knows, he went to the class two times and he has two certificates. Okay, okay. And he fully well know what to do and how to, what to tell the staff them. And each and every day I'm here, I'm behind the back. And I enjoy doing this. Thing. I see you have a lot of trophies here. Tell me about them. Yeah, this is the trophy that we won. Um, we have started in 2005 and we played 12 tournaments. Oh, yes, cricket? Cricket, yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> in 2005, Rockaway Cricket team has gone and we have played 12 tournaments. And we go up onto the 12, we won 10. 10. Wow. 10 tournaments we won. Um, a few years now, we have taken the back bench and the youngsters to go ahead. Uh, you know, the body is not at the age of 60, you can't play the game of cricket anymore. <laughs> but I noticed you support cricket a lot. If you go on Sunday around New York City, you will see a lot of uh, guys with, with a t shirt is Rockaway and a big Rockaway. Okay. I always sponsor a lot of because these guys them support my restaurant. So in return, I support them you know, by helping them with the uniform. So. That's really good. She's your mother in law? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. And she make all these delicious bread? <laughs>
What's your name? Anne. Anne is making some delicious good curry. This looks good, Anne. Smells good. <laughs> Nicholas, he, he, he charge almost no, everything nice here. <laughs> we make our own planting plantain chip. chip. <laughs> nice. So you can come and get rock we planting chip here. Fresh. <laughs> and this is the big chef here. Okay. The big chef Anne, who is the boy. Oh, this is Anne. This is Anne. I Anne. thought she was Anne. No, no, Anne been here. Anne, Anne got curry smelling really nice. Uh, so Anne, big, Anne is the one who is responsible for all the curry that cook a rock of roti shop. Wow, and no she has been here about 15 years working with us. Wow. Every morning, four o'clock, she is here. Yeah, <laughs> doing a great job. All the curry is Anne is the one who could eat it. Okay, so uh, tell us about living in Guyana. How was life back then? <laughs> it's hard to know. We have to leave our country and get away. Life was okay until we had a problem with the government. Where a lot of people might know this is the wrong government time, the time when the teachers and the staff working with the government has to go and work at the estate. Who can remember that? And they go and when you work, you get a hamper. At the same time, they ban flower. They take you to the belt to the estate to do cleaning and cutting bush. The teachers and all the government service. The same place we was planting until the government they took away all the land that we was planting. It was, uh, they took it away from Sankar, the estate, and we was planting there. And we was leasing from them oh. until they took away our crop. Mm. Uh, same thing, the band, kasa, band flower, we had 18 acres, three cassava, ready to full. So the five acre rice, five acre garden. I remember as a little boy, I was 17 years. I went and offered so many do But you know what? The time has reached. The time didn't reach for us to be there. And the Almighty has sent us to New York. After a couple of years, we have literally furnished. If I was in Guyana, I could have never be the happy so rocky I am today. Yeah. God gave me a test, and I stand out. I always believe in the Almighty. You said you did fish and work too? Yeah, after they had the disappointment with the government took over land. Mm -hmm. And they said we work on fishing boat. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, I was not a fisherman, but I was forced to become a fisherman. Okay. <laughs> Go out at sea to spend many days? Yeah. You did that? I remember I spent 17, 18 days. Wow. Uh, I remember I work on trawler, spent six, seven weeks. Wow. Uh, leave your home, you can't see back land until seven weeks. Mm -hmm. but, you know, young and full of energy. Right. <laughs> Enjoy it. Yes, yes. Yeah, well, until uh, I went to Trinidad and get a visa from Trinidad to come to the U.S. Okay. And from the day I came here, I didn't look back. <laughs> what you started doing when you came? I was my first job was working at a gas station, mm -hmm. a merit gas station. Mm -hmm. uh, I enjoy it. I used to work eleven to seven, and I enjoy it, but. Uh, my friend told me about driving taxi. I said, I can't drive. I can't drive. Mm -hmm. I can only ride bicycle. Right. I make my mind up and I get my license in the morning and the afternoon. I started drive taxi in New York. Wow. It was amazing. Yeah. I did private car, private car until I get my legal car. And I enjoyed it. I, my desire was to put on my suit and tie. And mm -hmm. I did. I wow. went to Manhattan. I enjoy working there with a corporate company, uh, right into your executive, wow. take them home, take them to meeting, and I enjoy it until I had an opportunity to, where I understand Rockaway Car Service was selling, that is back in 1999. Uh -huh. 
And it was tough for me, the decision to me, because I was making money. I was making real good money driving limousine. Okay. So I had to make a decision. It's to live there or, or to buy Rockwell Sierra. But I did make a decision to take Rockwell. Our service not too far from here. And then okay. it was a golden opportunity. And okay. It was a testing moment for me. Uh-huh. And I was very, very, very successful. Uh-huh. Uh, at one time, after a year or so, I was so depressed because the built the committee board want to close me down. Oh, okay. Rockaway never used to have a legit car, it was all private car. But I went around to the hotel <laughs> and the airline and I started to get business. So we had to get only legit car. We kind of were on the TLC and register on the TLC and then I had a lot of cars. Taxi 50, service. 50, 50 to 70 cars registered on the Rockaway. Mm -hmm. And then we had to force, literally force to get a parking for them. Wow. They promised me to close me down. So every time I was driving around, I was looking for a parking lot. Parking lot. Mm -hmm. Until one day, I called my brother. <coughs> this was a rundown gas station. So I actually, do you know who owned this rundown gas station? Eh? Unfortunately, we said, do you want it to buy? The guy is in my office right now. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's in 2003. Mm -hmm. And that's the way I bought this place here. It's a rundown gas station. The bank would not have lend me money. Thank you. Would not lend it. Would not because uh, because of the because of the oil com contaminated with the soil. Uh -huh. And it was a rundown gas station, abandoned gas station. Mm -hmm. So I had to went and get hard money to borrow. Okay. And I did it. I cleared the tank. That's 2003. And then 2005, this restaurant was open. Wow. And from the time the restaurant opened, we, uh, Marshall, I'm doing it. Good, you can't complain. Uh, and a few years afterward, I made the upstairs. So, uh, this is the Rockaway. This is the uh, Rockaway Enterprise. The restaurant is here, the car service is over the other side, and the Royal Impress Hall is upstairs. Oh. That's a brief about Mr. Rockaway, his oh. lifestyle in America. Uh, how, how you got started? How did he achieve it? Very good. Very interesting story. I hope you motivate some people. Like I said the last time in the other video when you did the um, iftar, that you, I hope you motivate people to do the same. And I guess your story, I guess, would inspire other people and motivate them as well. But I always been, feel happy to do that. And it's not here, in Guyana, here alone. I do it in Guyana. I do it a lot every time I go to Guyana. I go all the length and breadth of Guyana and do it with food and hamper. And all kind of things to people. Not in Guyana, though, in Trinidad, in different parts. In That's when you um, visit. And right. I support a lot of things in Senegal. I spent a lot of money this year. I have some Senegal guys for working with me. Mm -hmm. And I support a lot of organizations. Good. That's very good. Yeah. Okay. So we are upstairs right now in the Royal Empress Hall. And they're doing some decoration here. Like we have a preparation for an event. And we're gonna show you just now. What was the decoration first? Well, so my son getting married tomorrow um, Sunday. Oh, really? Congratulations! My little son getting married Sunday here. Uh -huh. Yeah, Javid getting married to Cindy. Uh huh. Right here Sunday, at three o'clock. Okay, so you start the preparation with the decoration. Like yeah, we started doing the decoration. So you okay. see, I have a body here. Yeah. Yesterday was Cindy body, so okay. we had a little. They had a little get together. Some of her family are here from Trinidad. So okay. there was over here, she's and we had a little. Cut, yeah, she's from Trinidad. Okay. Yeah. In fact, two, two of my brothers married to Trinidad too. I uh, probably Danese. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. So uh, this this is the view of the Royal Impress Hall. Okay. When you want to have a look at the Royal Impress Hall, this is it here. This is what the Royal Empress Hall looks like. With all the beautiful decorations and the lovely table. Well, they're setting it up, so excuse that area. And they're preparing for the wedding. And it was so good that they were able to decorate this and transform it into a prayer hall and everything for the iftar. Uh, this is the decorators. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. So this is um, Brother Hafiz and his yeah. wife. And what's your name? Floretta. Floretta. And the yeah. cute baby Zain, mashallah. This is Zain Hamdan. Hi Zain. <laughs> uh, <hi> Zain. <laughs> You're so sweet. <laughs> 
Yeah. How old is he? How old is he? Six months. Hi. How are you? He's a big boy now. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations on this beautiful place you have here. Thank you. Yeah, you guys are so humble, despite what you have, which is very good. That's the yeah, that's the spirit, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 Determination. You from, yes. Yeah, yeah. You work hard and you achieve this, and yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, Determination yeah. is the key to success. Definitely. Yeah, yes, yeah. Yes. I know it, it didn't come overnight. Yeah, if you work hard with a clean mind and determine, you will get there. You know, you know, the opportunity is here. And if you, you work towards it, you can get it. But if you don't work towards it, it's like an exam. Right in an exam, you, you have to study for the exam. That's Same true. thing. Mm -hmm. You work hard in life, you will achieve good things in life. Mm -hmm. And you have a good mind, a clean mind, good things will follow you. Definitely. <laughs> I love yeah. those words of wisdom and the advice you, you, you're giving, you know. <laughs> Coming from a successful person, you yeah. know, people should um, learn to follow so these. As, I, as a kid growing up, I never had... I listen to a person like why I advise person, a successful person advising people, you know, what giving yeah. and determination. But well, you know what, the Almighty have blessed me to get it. Yes. The determination okay. is the key to success, and I see it and I work for it. That's true, and you have a good person by your side. Yeah. To help you with this success. That's very yes, good. Yes, you did. Yes. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you, I know I was here for the yeah. iftar, but you were so busy. I know I was so busy. <laughs> yes, okay. we didn't get the time. I know. I see you around, but we didn't get the time. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I know. Your video did really well. I did for the yeah, iftar. I see, yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. I see happy. it one night people did and I saw it. See good, yes. You got a lot of positive feedback. Yeah. 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 Good work. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Okay. All right. Thank you so much thank for coming out. I really appreciate yeah. it. Yeah, you're most welcome. It's a pleasure. Yeah. So we have an elevator right here. Together. Yeah. <laughs> guys. So guys, I wasn't able to show yeah, you ahead. what we did on Eid Day itself, but um, I'm going to show some of the goodies we had on that day, and I uh, hope you enjoy. I'm like, um, Eid Mubarak, everybody. Mubarak. Eid Mubarak. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. I do hope yeah. you enjoyed the video. Uh, we had a good tour here yeah, at the Rock Wave like Shop. Um, we have a you saw the owners are so humble and nice, and um, it was a pleasure being here and highlighting their good work.
Thank you. And please remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And uh, keep supporting the channel. Yeah, see you in the next video.